Another day, another video tour. Let's explore this brand new 3-bedroom house and lot with roof deck in Bacoor City. But before we proceed, please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and follow for more videos like this. Check out the natin yung exterior. Here on the right side is a pocket garden with faux grass already laid out. And on the left side is a planter, which adds aesthetic to the home. This home has 3 bedrooms, 3 bathrooms, and 1 parking space. This is a newly built home with roof deck, balcony, inside an elevated gated community, and only 500 meters from SM Bacoor. Over on this side is your lanai, and you have a sliding door which serves as an access to your dining area. But you can also definitely eat out here for that al fresco dining. Going further at the back of the property is your service area. You have your dirty kitchen over here and also a space for your washing machine. So you can definitely do your laundry over here. And on the left side is your kitchen access. So when you get home from the supermarket, you can grab your groceries from the car and go straight to the kitchen. Now let's proceed to the interior of the home. Here you have your solid wood front door and it opens up to the living space. Both the first and second floors are already fully tiled and painted. There are large windows all throughout the house for that natural light and ventilation. You have a full bathroom on the ground floor so it has a shower, toilet, and sink. And it also has floor to ceiling tiles. Beside the bathroom is the stairs leading up to the second floor. This is your potential dining area with an access to the lanai. You get a glimpse of your dirty kitchen once again. Now let's head on over to the main kitchen. The kitchen has ample cabinetry and counter space. It also has a backsplash, sink, and a provision for the refrigerator. What I like about having a separate kitchen from the living space is that when there is a guest or a visitor, the chaos that's going behind the scenes when you're cooking or when you're baking cannot be seen immediately by the visitors or anyone in the sala. Remember the access door that we saw earlier in the service area? Well, here's another view from the kitchen this time. Now that we're done with the ground floor, let's proceed to the second floor. The stairs are actually made out of wood, while the railings are made out of metal. You'll notice that the stairs are bright, and that's because of the huge windows all throughout this home. Upon landing on the second floor, you'll see immediately to your left the family area. You also have a good sized balcony here on the second floor. At the front of the property, you can put in some nice chairs and a coffee table for when you have that morning coffee or tea, whichever you prefer. Going back inside the home, you'll see the staircase again which is the access point to the third floor or the roof deck. This family area is just perfect for those intimate moments with your family. Go ahead and set up a sofa, a TV for that movie night so you can Netflix and chill. Netflix, baka naman. Now let's go inside the primary bedroom. The primary bedroom is an easy access from the stairs and it has a large window. It lets in a lot of natural light so if you're a plantita or a plantito, this could definitely be your home. Your indoor plants are gonna get so much love from the sun. All bedrooms already have their own cabinetry so you can just move in your clothes here, your personal belongings as well and you're ready to go. The primary bedroom has its own bathroom and it's already tiled and complete with bathroom fixtures. It even has a bidet and will never go back, am I right? And that's the primary bedroom for you. Now let's go to the second bedroom. 
The second bedroom is just beside the stairs. Now with any bedroom, you can turn this into anything you want. For example, you can make it an office space. And of course, it has a cabinet and a window facing some greeneries. There's also already a provision for a window type air conditioning unit. If I were to live in this home, I would put an office desk and chair right over on this corner because it has a pretty cool view. Now let's see what's behind door number 3. This is the second floor common bathroom which is to be shared by the second and third bedroom. Again, you already have your bathroom fixtures and it's already tiled. It actually has a similar tile to the primary bedroom, just a different color. I like the floor tiles that they used in both bathrooms because it looks like it's mosaic. Let's take a look at the third and final bedroom. This bedroom has three windows, so the ventilation here is super nice. It also has a provision for a window type AC, and of course, they included a cabinetry right in this room. Now that we're done with the second floor, shall we go see the roof deck? Do you have your sunglasses on? Welcome to the roof deck. These are your views. So what can you do with a roof deck? Well, it's very versatile. Personally, I would set up a uh, sampayan here. Feeling ko madali matuyo ang labahin dito. And tagusha, so it's not unsightly. And then some parts of it I would turn into a yoga area. And then the other parts I would turn into an entertainment space. Just imagine yourself lounging here at night, looking at the stars. What would you turn this space into? Here's the access again to the stairs, and we are done. So that's it for our video tour. If you like this property, go ahead and schedule a viewing. Or if you have any more questions, here's my contact info. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow for more content like this. This has been Agent Jana, and see you in the next property.